Hey everyone, today is Yoko Ono's birthday. She's turning 90. So if you want to, feel free to go to wishtreeforyokoono.com and put a wish on the virtual birthday tree. Thanks. Let's get into the video. There are really no words to describe how much that Yoko Ono's music and story has helped me throughout the past year. I first heard her most recent Warzone album in 2018, and I admired her commitment to peace. I heard her 1981 album Season of Glass in 2021, and I admired her bravery after John died. In 2022, I listened to the rest of her discography, even the more experimental stuff that she did with John Lennon, which I grew to enjoy. Listening to her albums such as Feeling the Space, Star Peace, or Take Me to the Land of Hell, I realized how much the world needs to catch up to Yoko's vision. On the internet, a lot of racist, hateful fans still believe Yoko is a screaming lady who broke up the Beatles and ruined John's life. She's way more than that. And for people to continue this hurtful narrative on a 90-year-old woman pains me and many other Yoko fans I've gotten to know on my channel. But I want to talk about the positives. When I listen to Yoko Ono's music, I feel at peace. I think about everything she's been through and I smile knowing that she survived and she's now helping and inspiring others. Happy birthday, queen. Never stop being you. We love you. Thanks, Yoko. Peace.